now into other parts of Africa. Tanzania's Vice President Samir Hassan has been sworn in as President, becoming the fourth female head of state in the East African country following the death of her predecessor. Hassan was sworn in at State House in the country's commercial capital, Dar es Salaam. Tanzania's first female president was sworn in on Friday, following the death of John Magafuli. Samia Suluhu Hassan was sworn in at State House in the commercial capital Dar es Salaam. She is the East African country's sixth president since independence from Britain in 1961. Hassan is also the country's first head of state from the semi-autonomous Zanzibar archipelago. Tanzanian politics have traditionally been dominated by politicians from the mainland. Described as a softly spoken consensus builder, Hassan's leadership style is seen as a potential contrast to brash populist Magafuli. The vocal coronavirus skeptic had not been seen in public for more than two weeks when Hassan announced his death on Wednesday. She will now have to grapple with the health impact of COVID-19 that her predecessor long denied, including whether to procure vaccines. Hassan also faces the pandemic's economic consequences in a country polarised by six years of Magafuli's rule. A meanwhile, late President Magafuli will be buried on March the 25th in his native town, Chato, in the Gaeta region. The burial date was announced by his successor, Sami Hassan, after she took the oath of office. Magafuli's body will lie in state this weekend at the National Stadium for people to pay to last respect. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.